<coughs> hey Capricorn, what's up? Welcome to your reading. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. This person here could have ghosted you, Capricorn. With a helmet here. Okay. This is someone who's ghosted you, who's just completely pulled away. If you're in a relationship with them, uh, then they're with you, but they're still very detached. If you're not in a relationship with them, if you've broken up, if you're separated, then this person is doing a lot of contemplation. They're doing a lot of deep thinking. They're doing a lot of soul searching, okay? A lot of self-introspection about what they should do next about this. <coughs> Sorry. But uh, I feel right now uh, this person really, really wants to or has needed their time alone. This person has been spending time, a lot of time alone, deeply thinking. They could be taking a lot of guidance from the universe or probably from elders or, you know, they're getting wiser is what I'm getting here with this time alone. So if they've completely ghosted you, it's okay. Don't contact them because this, this person needs this time alone. They're just getting more and more wiser out here, okay? Uh, I feel that uh, this person does feel very, very lonely. But at the same time out here, I feel this person here is getting more mature. Okay, so give them this time out here. Even if they have, let them be where they are. <clears throat> with the seven of pentacles in their feelings here, this person has put in a lot of hard work. I feel you're dealing with someone here who probably feels that um, this relationship is a long-term investment and now they're waiting and watching. There is <clears throat> some kind of energy where they put in all the hard work and now they're very close to getting success with you. But right now, this is good. This is positive investment, okay? This is something where you'll get the fruits of your labor. So they're waiting and watching. But you're dealing with someone here right now. Overall, I don't see that very impulsive energy, okay? Although with the aid of wands here, in their feelings, they would want to talk to you like right now, okay? Communication. They're just watching you from a distance, keeping an eye on you, waiting for the right moment. And you can expect a lot of communication, back and forth they could be wanting to travel towards you they could be it's like i'm getting someone who's desperate they're crazily thinking about uh, wanting to communicate with you and talk to you okay there's a lot of passion also coming from this person's side <coughs> overall but with the seven of pentacles here i feel that this person here has planned they are uh, they put in a lot of work here and now they're it's more like a wait and watch energy like what do i want to do next do i want to invest more should I invest more? How should I invest more? But they want a very slow, steady, patient approach. Their approach is not impulsive right now, okay? And their feelings here because they're maturing, right? They're trying to get a lot of knowledge out here. With the emperor here, <clears throat> this person, I do feel that is someone here who is very controlling. Now, you could be dealing with someone here who probably, um, they communicate when they want to communicate with you. If you want to communicate with them and if they don't feel like they won't communicate with you. I'm getting someone here where I'll communicate when I want to communicate with you. If I don't want to communicate, I'm not going to communicate with you. I'll just ghost you. I'll just fucking ghost you. <coughs> You're dealing with someone here who's very rigid, stubborn ass, very, very, they lack flexibility. This person's not flexible at all. That's a very difficult person to stay with, by the way. They do what they want when they want. They're just like that. But they want to see to it that they have full control over the situation. They want to talk to you, but they don't want to come off as desperate. They don't want to make you feel that you have control over the situation. Here. I'm just telling you what the truth is. They don't want to let you know that you have control over the situation. They don't want to make you feel that you, you have them wrapped around, uh, you know, uh, <clears throat> their finger. This person here is um, so... They have a lot of emotions for you, but the thing is that they are being very logical right now. They're being very practical. They are not the best at expressing their emotions, and even if they do, they feel it's more it's more smarter to not express their emotions and shut off their emotions and just be more practical about it, just be more logical about it. Okay, but there could be an ego tussle, between, ego tussle between you both. I feel that you probably both blocked each other or if you block them, for them it's like, um, if you block them, for them it's like, how the hell can this person block me? Okay, that's what I'm getting here. But they're, they're, they're um, putting their foot down and there's like a no compromise from them is what I'm getting here. That's like somebody who's like, I, I want what I want, my way or the highway. <clears throat> I'm getting for a few of you, even if this person knows they are wrong, 
even though they know that they need to initiate the communication even though they know that they've done the wrong thing out here they're still going to want to have the upper hand <coughs> what's the seven of pentacles let's see why they're waiting what's the wait and watch the sun here they could be waiting for some kind of clarity out here or they're just waiting ace of cups they want a brand new emotional beginning with you here okay this person could be waiting for a new beginning with you this person could be waiting on some clarity or uh, they have the clarity and now there's like a wait and watch here so i'm feeling here with whatever with a hermit card here whatever guidance whatever divine guidance they were looking for whatever uh, advice they were looking for or whatever soul searching or self introspection they had to do about this connection they have the clarity and now there's this wait and watch where they want to take a step one by one i feel this is more for planning like how do i go about with this because they definitely want it with you they want to have this emotional cycle with you they want a brand new beginning with you what's the emperor <coughs> very egoistic person but what's the emperor here who's the emperor <laughs> ace of cups with a four of cups <coughs> again we have ace of cups <coughs> this person here is missing you like crazy now i feel for a few of you this person could have gone around looking at other options also just because of their ego like you know if if uh, you block me or whatever it is i'm not going to come running around to you because i am the emperor here okay ego is uh, running the show for them okay their ego is running the show so they could have gone around looking for other options also but none of the options were satisfying them okay they were very very emotionally disappointed and none of the options either they were not interested in any of the options or the options that they were looking for they were trying to replace you they couldn't and uh, they were just not finding you in anyone all right but with ace of cups you now this person wants a brand new beginning with you <clears throat> which is the clarity that they got is what i'm getting what are this person's intentions what are this person's intentions towards uh, capricorn shit i forgot who i was reading for <laughs> this person does have a lot of regret this person is very very obsessed with you very addicted to you okay your a connection that they can never let go now first of all in their intention here with eight of swords so i feel in the past year this person here could have been very stuck in their head they could have had a lot of mental blocks uh they could have been thinking of the worst this person could have been thinking <coughs> very logically this person could have surrounded themselves with their own mind prison okay where they feel like every road that leads towards you is either not possible or it's just very confusing so i feel that they were in their head they were living in their head all this while here in the past year and it's almost like they saw no solution even if they wanted something with you they couldn't see a clear cut solution here okay so they probably felt like something is just next to impossible so that's a lot of fear based thoughts okay where either they were very restricted because they had the obligations of other people or other people's opinions were keeping them restricted or they were just restricted because they they had a lot of fear based thoughts now i feel with a fool here this person wants to take a risk they want to take a leap of faith with you okay they want to start brand new they want to start from scratch they want to delete everything that happened in the past between you both and now they want to start um, a brand new beginning with you um, <clears throat> yeah they want to take that risk towards you here with the lovers here in their intention here this person is ready to make that choice okay so the choice could have been uh, very very difficult for them the lovers is uh, they feel a very strong twin flame connection to you maybe this is your twin flame out here but earlier i feel that this person here was trying to avoid commitment trying to avoid this relationship uh, or trying to uh, avoid giving you some kind of a deeper level of commitment or trying to give you some kind of um <clears throat> a stability security okay but i do feel that this was someone here who was trying to avoid commitment for a very long time out here because this could be like a life changing decision decision for them but they're finally doing it and when their intention with a judgment here this person wants a reconciliation if things were over between you both here think again this person wants to bring back a dead situation back they want to have a revival of this connection if it was over between you both if that's not what the uh, if there has been no separation between you both here if you're in the connection here then this person here now wants to try they start to uh, try this connection all over again with you 
ready to uh, make a decision which is like almost like life changing out here on the verge of making a life changing decision which is good for their soul making a decision which is good for their soul and not making a decision which gives them instant gratification which they have been doing all this while out here but with the judgment here i feel this person here wants a rebirth of this connection they want to bring back the relationship from the dead and they want to start over again they have a lot of they had this huge awakening is what i'm getting here for a lot of you okay there's a huge awakening there's a huge realization like i fucked up and uh, now they want to make it happen with you okay they do have a lot of regret they do have a lot of regret here there's a lot of emotional disappointment they do know that they have disappointed you even though you trusted them so much here but in their intentions they definitely want a reconciliation and they're wanting to make the right choice this time around okay so that's what i have for you um hope this reading resonates and i'll see you next time bye bye i'll see you next time bye bye i'll see you next time bye bye i'll see you next